Okay, let me make this video. Okay, so very good inspiring video about how thoughts can manifest reality. This seems to be how the universe works. Thought forms manifest reality. Intentions create reality. The video above talks about how to put this in practice, into practice. It's very well done. So based on my research, not just, um, I mean, my overall research and my thinking about life and everything, I think that's sort of, I'm coming to the realization. So just one second. So what is the purpose of life? The purpose of life, well, it is to live your best life. Uh, it doesn't matter where you are, what you do. Live your best life. Make the most of it. Use your consciousness, this gift. Enjoy your life. I mean, this is a video called The Gift. Anyway, so this is a conclusion I've come to after all these years of research, thinking, and life experience. It's not about aliens or God or gods, though those subjects can be quite interesting in themselves. It's about you and I. This is what life is about. It's about the I. The universe seems to be set up just so you can have this conscious experience. So make the most of it. Take universe. I am going to live my best life. I've been struggling quite a lot these past few years. My health has taken a hit, mainly, I believe, due to poor nutrition, inept self-care habits like, shower, like not showering regularly, and an inactive lifestyle, sitting in my room all the time in front of the computer, rarely leaving the room and almost never leaving the house, even to go to the backyard. I have started to take some steps to alleviate this. I have started to eat properly, take more regular showers, go out into the backyard, spend some time in the shade and expose my eyes to the sunlight. It is going to be a long journey, but this is what this is, a journey. I'm not here to achieve facts or obtain facts or goals or anything. Uh, it's, it's good to have goals. It's a good, good. I mean, I do have... Uh, and that's a motivation, but I'm here to learn and grow. I think this is what we are here for. Or oh, I'm here to experience what life is like as a, as, a, as a human being. Who are we? So it's a human specifically. I mean, who are we as humans? Who are we? I think we humans are thought forms having conscious experience in these bodily vessels. We are ultimately thought forms, thinkers. What we think we create, which for the moment, when we are incarnated in these bodily forms, happens through the experience of time. Because thought happens instantly. But in, in order for something to happen in our 3D reality, the time is a factor. The universe was created by a thinker, and that thinker is in us, each one of us, and others, and all else, experiencing itself through us, and all that is. I am here because I want to be here, even if that want is driven by some kind of unspoken compulsion, which can be a fear of dying, or a desire for something, or need. I think all of these factors come into play. Uh, that sounds a bit negative, but <laughs> anyway, um, so I'm going to enjoy my life as best I'm going to enjoy my life 
as best I can. I'm going to treasure. Going to treasure. Or try to. The little moments. I'm going to enjoy what it like. What I'm going to um. No. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. So I'm going to. Uh, sometimes you know it, it it can be hard because you know there are these fears, but you know. I'm gonna, but that's also part of being human is to experience fear, love, hate, joy. This is this is what it means to be human is to experience emotions. I think there are aliens, other entities. They might not ha be able to experience emotion. And then I, I've heard that they envy us because we experience emotion. And maybe we came here in this human form so we can experience emotion as human beings because there are other beings which are not, you know, Oh, well, there might be other aliens, entities who also experience emotions. I mean, animals experience emotions. So, I mean, I guess, you know, um, let me try. I, I'm just going to try and, you know, practice. I'm going to practice gratitude. Sometimes it's not easy, you know, because you feel like, oh, I'm complaining, I'm, oh, why is my life so difficult? Well, sometimes, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting to a point where I'm like, oh, gratitude. I'm also going to try and, uh, I'm also, I'm also going to try and be, I don't like it, try to be humble it doesn't mean like you put yourself down it just means that you know i have limitations you know i have limitations i have bodily limitations my body you know you know <laughs> i was growing with age you know my birthday is coming soon so it's just like my body is, is, is uh, you know it's, it's not going to be healthy for you know forever you know so i have to enjoy like my my, you know, my, my sight, my hearing, um, my touch, my my teeth, my. Uh, I, I'm going to try and enjoy my body, uh, and what it provides, because that's what it means to be human is to have a body. So I'm um, going to try to to enjoy my body. And the sensations and uh, emotions it provides. Um, yeah, that, that's, a, that's an experience. It's, 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 you know, we are not our bodies. We are souls having a bodily experience. I, I do believe that. You know, we are here. Uh, basically, uh, you know, I've been watching a lot of videos on aliens and things and that sort of helped me move to this direction of the reason I was so interested in the aliens is because that's about reality about truth and you know and also about God you know it's about who, who, who created the universe and by doing all that research I'm coming to this conclusion that hey this is all about me At the end of the day it's about me and, and uh, what do I want and what I like like in those webinars I was watching what do I want what do I want who am I what do I want and I want to enjoy my life I don't want to suffer and be depressed all day and just worry about the future and you know just feeling like a little point I said, no, no I want to have I want to treasure these moments because I, because I'm realizing that there's a whole lot of life out there there's, there are aliens, there are interdimensional entities, and we're, this is like a temporary experience. And I think if humans were told the truth about who they are, that you know, let's say, you know, we come in, we are spiritual beings, souls, and we incarnate into these bodies, and if we knew that, then maybe we would treasure our experience a lot more than like uh, right now we are all being manipulated and controlled and you know, being abused in such a profound way through all this ignorance and manipulation but no I, I think because we don't have 
telepathy. Uh, I think our ancestors maybe had them. And anyway, yeah, it's about you. What do you want to do? I want to. I want to enjoy my life. Yes, I don't want my life to be a daily struggle. I don't want to feel like, why am I getting up every day? That's what it's been like for all these years. It's like, why am I getting up? It's so difficult to get up and do anything, you know, brush my teeth, eat, you know, eat my food. This is like such a such a chore, and so depressing. And I'm like, I'm sort of like getting out of that mindset. No, I don't want to be like this. I want to treasure what I have. I'm here having a temporary experience as a human being. <laughs> and I want to enjoy it. I don't want to suffer. I don't want to suffer. 